Hey YouTube, Pipe Pals, family and friends. I just wanted to come on quickly to uh, thank everybody for their for the support that uh, everyone's shown on Facebook and Instagram and and over the phone. Um, I really do appreciate it. Um, pretty much every day after work, I'm a I'm an oncology nurse. I infuse chemotherapy drugs. After that. I come out here and I'm working on the house. Uh, today I'm removing popcorn ceiling and uh, bleaching the weather walls. They're starting to grow mold and so I'm bleaching all the walls. Um, I'm let the bleach dry and then hit them up again. Anyway, I just wanted to come on real quick and, and uh, thank everybody. Uh, Rachel and I are gonna get on this weekend before we come out to the house and start working. And uh, we're gonna tell our story about uh, what happened and the flooding and and everything. Um, maybe show a little bit of the house once we get out here and uh, what we plan on doing and and uh, anyway. Thank thank you everyone. It, uh, it really does mean a lot uh, um, to me, Rachel, and uh, our six kids um, trying to get the house livable um, to get everybody together again uh, will be, uh, be great. Um, my three kids are with my ex-wife, haven't seen them in a little bit. We got together this weekend, we pulled some nails and that kind of stuff. Um, nothing fun. <laughs> I told them the weekend after next I'll take them out to something fun, maybe to a movie or something and, and uh, we'll, do, we'll do that. And uh, Rachel's kids are with her ex-husband, um, both houses, uh, they didn't flood, so they have a, they have a home to stay at. We are staying with um, Rachel's mom, my mother-in-law. She's been gracious enough to uh, to house us for as long as as long as we need to. And uh, the next thing we need to do is uh, get the air conditioner. Um, this house isn't going to dry out until we until we get the air conditioner running. It the one we have went underwater by about three by about three inches. We even lifted it up on blocks as, as far as we could, and uh, it was just barely touching their conditioner when we were forced to leave, when we uh, mandatory evacuation that came up to the door right here and said, you gotta go, so we left. Probably could have saved a lot more if I stayed, but um, the Coast Guard thought it'd be a good idea that we that we leave since we had we had a few inches of water in the house. Some of you have seen that video. I posted little snippets of video, uh, no commentary, just little ones, just to, just to, you know, show you guys what what we went through right before we we evacuated. Um, oh, that's it. That's it. Um, thank you, thank you, everyone, for uh, for your support. I really do appreciate it. Um, thank you, Angela and Brian, for for rallying the troops. And uh, thank you everyone for their donations and kind words of encouragement. And uh, that's it. Uh, fair winds, following seas, till we meet again. And uh, stay tuned for Rachel and I's story uh, about what went down. All right, guys. See you. And thank you.